Okay, so I wanted to make this video real quick for you guys because, again, I know a lot of you guys rely on my opinion for your, your confidence in the audio equipment that I recommend, which kind of saddens me, but um, I have the utmost confidence recommending the DT990 to everybody. And again, I wanted to talk about this. There are a lot of expensive headphones. And the thing about headphones is, again, I've looked at every single one of them. I've listened to a lot of sound demos. I can hear the tone. I know how to voice audio equipment 100% correctly. Even the most expensive headphones are riddled with problems. Riddled. I mean, you listen to them, the tone is all fucked up. Okay, it's, it's just something about headphones and you can spend a lot of money and end up with a piece of fucking shit okay and the DT990s again after you use them for a few weeks a few months you know you get some new pads you use them for a few weeks I mean it's not going to get any better okay I want you guys to understand that like these are some of the best if not best performing headphones on the market and you will hear a little bit of 6 kilohertz fatigue, and you can blame it on the pads. Okay, so again, when you get them, they're going to be really shrill. Really, you know, it's going to be hilarious. That goes away after a few months, and it never comes back. I don't care what anybody says, it never fully comes back. You get new pads, that shrillness is not going to come back to the same degree. Okay, so people are like, oh, it's, it's the pads, it's only the pads, it's not the drivers. And there, I believe, you know, there's some... You know, a, some has to do with the drivers. I, you know, if you want my honest opinion. Because it doesn't fully come back ever again, the harsh shrillness. It, it never comes back to that same degree as when you first get them. It just, it just doesn't come back like that. Um, so again, it's the pads, okay? And I, I, I hope that boosts your confidence, okay? When, you know, you, you hear any fatigue, any funky coloration know that it's the pads. You are getting exceptionally good drivers in the headphones. Okay, it's just the pads. The pads, over time, colors the sound. And uh, there's a 6 kilohertz fatigue because of the pads, okay, for a few months, and then that goes away, and you got a few more months of goodness, and then it starts to get a little bad, and, you know, it, you just repeat the cycle. But again, I mean... I've very closely examined all the headphones on the market. They they are riddled with fatigue and peaks and cuts and all this bullshit. Okay. These headphones provide you with sound stage, dynamics, bass, treble, clarity. I mean, it gives you everything. It's like a supreme pizza. Okay. And if you put them on and you're not that impressed or there's, there's just no, it's not going to get any better. You can waste a ton of money like a dipshit. And you're going to end up with worse or just really fucked up shit. You're going to waste your, your time. You're going to waste your money. And it's never going to be like, I mean, you're never going to put on headphones and it's going to sound like real life. This is some of the closest shit you're going to get to that. Okay. The headphone community is a bunch of fucking losers. They really are inept, retarded fucking losers. Um... I am just very grateful that I was able to learn the shit the appropriate way so that I could get out of this shithole, you know. But um, I, I just want you guys to know that it's not going to get any better. Don't waste your money. Okay, move on to something new. Okay. Again, you can watch all my videos on it. I mean, they, they are riddled with fuck-ups. Okay, this is some of the closest shit you're going to get to perfection. Any fatigue you hear, you can blame it on the fucking pads, okay? Anyways, um, that's all I wanted to say. Because again, you know, I you know I know these headphones aren't completely perfect. Just again, buy some more pads because you're gonna need them. You know, within a year's period of time, the uh, these pads. The EDT-990V. I mean, these, these headphones will last you forever. Okay, again, I'm a perfectionist. I want the best. I was willing to spend a whole lot more, but there's nothing out there. 
Okay, I've looked at everything. Okay, so if, if for any reason you're just not 100% happy with these, just realize you're going to waste your fucking time and money hardcore. Real hard. You're going to get fucked in the ass by these companies. Real hard. If you're a tone-deaf idiot, you're going to get fucked over, okay? So settle down with, I want to buy these fanciful, well, I'm going to buy the DT 1990s because you shut, you're an idiot. You're a fucking moron, okay? Anyway, that's it. Have fun with your DT 990s. You're not going to get any closer to, like, lifelike realism. I mean, just buy them, be happy with them, move on, okay? You're not getting, you're not getting any closer. You're not to get, don't, shut up. Don't do it. Don't waste your money. Fuck all, just get out of the headphone community. They are fucking losers. They are brain dead morons who don't know a goddamn thing. Fuck them. They're shit. They're trash.